you know, this is my response video to a video that was sent to me at 4 o'clock in the morning about um, his little comments on things. You know, life is never guaranteed. We all know that. But to sit here and keep on saying over and over again what you've done for somebody, to me, tells me that you didn't want to do it in the first place, so why did you? I, I can say and do as I feel, like all of you do. I do not, I do not, let's say it again, you guys, together. Mr. Fudge, Pack and Pig. I've never said anything about your mom, nor would I, because I'm not... Ugh, I'm just not disgusting like you people are. I just want to mourn the death of my dog, who meant more to me than any of you. I'm getting tired of hearing it. I didn't build my channel on my ex-mods. Every night, y'all talking about me. Every night, y'all talking about me. Even if I didn't go live. Even if I didn't do a video. You're all talking about me. Why is it so important to everybody what I said about them? Does it matter? Is it going to change your life? Is it going to enable you from being a mom or a dad or a friend? I mean, what is it that's going to do to you guys to think that this irrelevant, fat broad from all around the shadows can do or say to change your lives? I want to thank Boss Up Nation. And uh, yeah, by the way, um, Smurf, you don't, you might own a domain to that server. But you do not own my name. You do not own us as a, as a whole. Get it right. You've never owned anything in your life. Except for what was given to you. And it's one of God's people. So you say you are the biggest hypocrite besides the other fat ass that you rock with. You know, gossiping is in the Bible. You know? You guys better start researching it. Y'all want to give... Um, shout outs to sex offenders. Y'all want to have sex offenders as mods on people's channels. Um, of a scurred from the law, that means they're on the run. Um, worry about that. Stop worrying about my past. It's my past. I don't worry about y'all's past. And um, by the way, hey, fudge pack and prick. I don't care what your past is. You don't enable me from moving forward. You don't enable me from being a mom or a daughter or a friend or a sister. But you keep saying all these things about me. Why does it matter to y'all? Please don't let me hinder any of your lives because none of you inhib inhibit me from moving forward and doing what I want to do. Just goes to show that YouTube has gone to another whole level. Something I don't think AGP would even be proud of. And um, ripping off the church... I never said that. What I said is, um, talking shit about people Monday through Saturday and praising God on Sunday doesn't make it right. Doesn't forgive either. But I'm not a priest or a minister. I'm just a human being that can say whatever she wants in relevance to her life. Please do not talk about my skills as being a mom because, um, let's, let's face it, you don't get the Father of the Fucking Year award, okay? None of them do. None of us do. We all make mistakes. Do I beat my child? Fuck no. Do I starve him? Hell no. Am I not here with him? Every fucking day. Does he have a new daddy in his life every day? No. I'm pretty proud of being a mom. But more importantly, I'm, I'm pretty proud of being a productive citizen. Unlike you guys who want to keep beating people down. You can only forgive... You want people to forgive y'all's past. Y'all don't want people to look into your life. We're not tricks. We're not trash bags. Um, we're not murderers. We're not any of those things. And just because you say it makes it right. You know, by the way, I got something to tell you. Hey, man in the shadow. We got the novel that you've been writing your stories out of. You just changed the alphabet. A, B, C, D, E, F, G. When is it going to be you catch me? Because I'm not running. I'm sitting right here every day. If your PO officer is looking for me, tell them to call the local police and bring me in for an investigation, interrogation. You're trying to say I'm guilty of something. You're innocent until proven guilty, bitch boy. I'm sorry that you feel your life has uh, brought you down some uh, 
windy roads, but leave me alone. And uh, Big Ange, we're going to be here for you through everything. I know you got some trials and tribulations going on, girl, but I love you. As a friend, you've been a powerful person. We do not attack, but we will stand up for each other because that's what friends do. And oh, by the way, Smurf, we did stand up for you, but you keep back floating. Because you give people money does not make it right what you do and say about these people. And I have not talked about Tattoo Bree Bunny since she's come back to boss up, so you're full of shit. Prove the proof or shut the fuck up. How about that? And, um, you know, I gave respect to a certain person because I blamed him for something. And maybe y'all should start staying positive. I'm never going to change who I am. I'm going to defend who I want to. And most importantly, I'm going to defend myself and my family. If any of you can prove that I've called any of your family members and talked shit on them or threatened them that you're going to call this person and that person if they don't give you a falsified um, interview, well, prove the proof or you shut the fuck up. No. I don't care who gave who what. You guys do it all day long. Stop. But I'll be live tonight because, you know, through all sadness comes glory. And apparently I need to come back out instead of letting me mourn. You guys can't do that. But it's not for me to judge. One day you'll be judged by your maker. And you better hope like hell you made it right. Because I know I have. All my dedications to anything I do will be to my dog. Because at the end of the day, she was the reason why I was happy. She died of old age, old girl did. And my daddy's not doing too well either, we're trying to get around, but we're going to do the best we can. Most importantly, we were family. My dog's my family, son, father, sisters, brothers, and I do have brothers and sisters, you dumbasses. You just didn't look too hard. And I've never, and let me say this one last time, ever been ashamed of my past, present, or my future. Don't care what y'all think of me. But I'll see all y'all tonight at 8. Y'all can come on in. I'm tired of talking about the same old shit. Y'all just make up your shit as you go along. Because your stories suck. They're not even freaking interesting. And maybe all y'all should concentrate within your homes. Take care of your own house. Vacuum your own floors. Wash your own walls. Clean your own fans. And leave me the fuck alone. So go eat your tacos. It's Tuesday. And this fish right here... Well, flop around. Just leave me the fudge alone. Okay, big boy? I don't need you to build my channel. I, I haven't talked about you in months until you got up there with your little, <laughs> your little butt buddy. I think something's going on. But everybody else? Oh, say hi, Albert. Okay, we got to go, you guys. We got to get on with our lives. Y'all have a great day and deuces, bitch.